And welcome back to Let's Play Alundra. I'm Northern Star Dragon. When we last left off, we had just en exited the maze in Navas Keep. So, now it's time to get to some item collection. If I can find her, uh, oh, yeah, Spring Bean. Sound don't crackle. Boing. Alright. And up here is. Yep, life vessel obtained. Life vessel number 49. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Now, there's also another important item that we do want to collect here while we're at it. Want to fall right here and get this chest. Yeah, that's right. Wind book obtained. There's a reason we want this, because for an upcoming battle because what well, what do you expect it's a dungeon there's gonna be there's gonna be a boss at the end of it wind book level 2 wind magic generates a huge tornado okay now do it now I wanna go in here Nava! Ugh. Is that you, Alundra? Zorgia just left. That traitor? What? He demanded that I give him the final crest, and when I refused... Here, take this stone. It place it in the alcove behind me. Hurry! Received the Zolist stone. Oh, crap! And I bet Zorgia is still around. Ta, nah. Zola Stone, Nava wanted you to take this. Yeah, I actually want to equip the wind book. Alundra finds a shelf high on the wall and carefully inserts the Zolist Stone. <gasps> it's the Diamond Crest! Oh, yeah, sorry. Oops, well, did a few seconds. Yeah, receive the diamond crest. There we go. Now we have all the crests. And sorry, I got a little ahead of myself. Shouldn't do that, because that's bad. It's time you knew the truth about Malzas. He's a ravenous monster from a distant star. And also, I noticed that his that I voice him somewhat the same as Zephyrus. It was through his beastly form was destroyed by the army of the king. But that was not the case. Oh, it was thought his beastly farm. <laughs> Hate it when I screw up words. It really bugs me. He was merely captured, not slain. The king was able to sense the power within Melzaz. He foolishly thought he could control the power and wield it himself. Can you fathom that? Ha! Melzaz sensed the king's lust for power and entered his dreams to give him fantastic visions. The king not only spared Malzaz, but elevated him to godlike status amongst his subjects. The people worshipped Malzaz reverently, becoming intoxicated with the dreams he gave them. Yeah, only dreams. A sanctuary was erected by the lake expressly for Malzaz. Fantastic images of him were created, then worshipped reverently. Then, when it was when it was least expected, Malzaz revealed his black heart and callous soul. He began to enter the minds of the people, not only as they slept, but also when they were awake. One night, the king had a horrid vision of Melzaz ruling the entire world, immersed in blood. It disturbed him so that he destroyed the images of Melzaz and sank the sanctuary. The lake was then bound by a magic seal, and the crest of the seal was divided into seven pieces. Really? Doesn't look like that. Man, eh, it could be some sort of weird magical means. He selected the most heroic in the land to be guardians of the crest fragments. Once entrusted with the crests, they were scattered to the far corners of the globe. Uh, you mean into this single land? Yeah, right. However, Melzaz has found others to worship him. Their prayers allow his soul to be fed. 
And what's worse, I'm afraid he's discovered the Merg. Powerful, fearsome beasts, too. Too simple to understand his evil designs. Sorgia! No! Bravo, Tyler. Bravo! I couldn't have explained it any more eloquently if I had tried. But then again, you have benefit. The benefit of 300 years of wisdom crammed into that wrinkled old noggin of yours. So, Alundra. How's life been since we saw each other last? I hope you did everything you've ever dreamed of doing. I really sh would rather not send you to your final resting place with any regrets. I just hate doing that. It's so sad. I want to know what my guilty little secret pleasure is. Want to know what my guilty se little secret pleasure it is, hmm? Merciless killing! Sinful bloodshed! Forced death! Yep, snuffing souls murdering in cold blood. Pulling the light from pathetic souls in need of release. Love it. When I snuffed out Narud right before your horrified eyes, I got especially sat an especially satisfying jolt of pleasure. You sick! Yeah. Was it the voyeurism? The thrill of killing for an audience? I don't know, but I intend to find out. So then, Relisa, shall we dance? Oh uh, yeah! Bring it on! Up. Oh. Yep. And... Don't black it. And it's boss time against Zorgia! Wow! Oh, bow, 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 ow, ow, ow! And use this against him, he doesn't like it. Yeah, you kind of want to wait for him to land. Uh, come on! Ah. Ah. Yeah, those energy blades are really finicky. Those things are... Oh, Jesus. Ah, sorry. The microphone seems to be a little finicky. Sorry. Ah, frickin' hell. It's avoiding these energy blades. Whoa! Take that, Sorgia! You murderous traitor! Haha! <laughs> it's really good if you can get him into a corner and use it because it hits since it hits him in the sky. Ah, dang it! Oh, and it sucks him in! Well, it is a tornado. Aha! Suck it, Zorgia! Yeah, and that does like 51 damage or so. So, yeah. These energy blades are a serious pain in the nog. Serious pain in the ass. Yeah, if you can get the blades to run into the walls. Oh! Rock! Oh, wow. That went by a lot smoother than... A lot more smooth, smoothly than last time. Curses! I knew my time to perish was coming. But to die like this is so very humiliating! HA! Suck it! Huh. Nava? Oh! And he's dead. What is this? It is I, Nava! You were wonderful, Olundra. I've never witnessed such a passionate fight. I used to think that my long life was a curse, but I was wrong. If I hadn't become a guardian, I wouldn't have met you. And I count that amongst my greatest joy. Joys, oh. 
The time is now upon us. Take the seven crests and insert them into the designated pedestals around the lake. When all the crests have been placed in the proper locations, the seal will be released from the lake. The final battle looms before you, Releaser. Good luck! I will use what remaining of my power to return you to the hum to my humble abode. Alundra, think of me as you battle the foul being that is Melzaz. The heavens shall cry out when his destruction is complete. And that's it. Yeah, that battle went by and what the hell? Yep, the stairs have collapsed and you can never return there, so better hope you've gotten those three items. Because otherwise you'd be locked out of a 100% run. Yeah. Yeah, I remember the last time. Oh my gosh, it took me so long. Then again, it also went by because I'd gotten that charged shot. Charged holy sword shot on him. Because yeah, 51 points of damage with this thing. Damn. Yeah, the legendary sword would only be able to get up to 54. Unless, of course, there's a cap, then... There, then that's another... Then that's a different case. Oh, wait. Wrong side. I don't need to go this way. Yeah, might as well go to the pub. And get some supplies from... Naomi's shop. Yeah, sorry, Naomi. Gotta... Gonna have to nick everything else that's there. Yep. Luckily, we can just fully heal at the pub side, at the pub. And why is this music playing? It should, it is not calm, it is not serene. And also you can fall down that well, but there's nothing in there. And the fountain stopped. And there's a pig! Pig, piggity piggity pig. Yeah, there's the, these are the only part, these are the only places you can go to. And receive the magic elixir. <laughs> oh, sorry, Naomi, I cleared out your shop. But it's for all the name. <laughs> It's all in the for the cause of goodwill and freedom and all that junk. <laughs> oh, jeez. And yeah, I would pause and restart it, but the thing is, I would I can't exactly pause it. I actually have to restart the recording every time. Oh, boy, we're going to get to the onto the final stretch of the game. Woohoo! And kind of aw, because I like playing this game. Though I won't miss the puzzles, that's for sure. And don't run into that. Ugh, some of the puzzles and the precision jumping! <laughs> hmm. Oh, don't go in there. Oh, boy. Yeah, Lurvy, I'm afraid this may be the last time I will ever be buying from you. Last two times. And also something funny. Yes! There we go! <laughs> Did it! <laughs> yeah, you can actually catch stuff if you're if you're fast enough. Well, I mainly think it's only just the herbs because it's so close. And there we go. We almost Oh still one more gilded falcon away from that gil from that spirit wand. Yep, 49. Oh, ah, I hate this. Sometimes the headphones feel like they're falling off. Okay, let's now let's actually get to the pub side bar, the Riverside Pub. What? what? I think I just smacked it to a wall. Because well, full heels. Heels, please. And yeah, that'll be the last time we'll ever s visit the pub. Oh. This way, right? Yeah! Screw you! <laughs> and you get to see this scene one last time before... Before I go to the lake. Yeah, right here. I can't! Because I'm still banned! Yeah, do 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 yeah, the shooting game's easy as hell.
<laughs> yeah. Oh, jeez. Strength and magic power have been completely refreshed! And go on a freaking run! As the video will go over. And, yeah. That shall be it. So, I've been Northern Star Dragon. This has been Let's Play Alundra, and I'll see you in the next video.